Hey there guys, your good old buddy, Eric from the Action Toys channel. And today, it is Monday. And what is Monday? It's a mail day! <laughs> okay guys, let's get into this, alright? So today we have... One, two, three packages. One from Amazon, two from Sellers. Alright, so we're going to do the Amazon one first, because I have no idea what's in there. <laughs> Funny if it's just completely different. Um, so, like anybody, I go on Amazon. I uh, order stuff, and sometimes I forget what I ordered. And then it shows up, and I'm like, what is this? Okay. Oh, cool. All right. Oh, it's another box. We've got some premium print PLA. Kilogram. Doesn't say what color it is. I know it is ABS. Tells you the printing temperature on here. That's pretty cool. Okay, now we're gonna open it and just so we can see what color it is. Because I think I ordered a few. Now I ordered this stuff um, for two reasons. One, I wanted flexible, stronger prints for accessories for the toys, and I wanted to be able to print airsoft stuff. Now. Our color is purple! Now, what can purple be? Purple can be um, Skeletor accessories. It could be anything I want it to be, really. It can be a Jutsu sword, because I am making a, a, an STI file, or an STL file. STI, oh my goodness. An STL file for that. So that's cool. That's the purple one. We'll put this back. Oh, put it back. Oh, there we go. She was tight. Sometimes. Like, like my model says, if it doesn't fit, make it. <laughs> All right, next one up is uh, our smaller package. All right, uh huh. So, looks like most of the tape's right there. Oh. And as always, guys, I cover up all the information. So if I, like um, some of the people I buy off of, um, it's like a giant circle of collectors in, in uh, Ontario. Well, it's all of Canada, but um, yeah. Sometimes I'll get a box and I'll have like eight, 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 eight or more different addresses on it, and everyone just recycles the box. So that's pretty cool. Okay, so we'll get here today. Cool, cool. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. If you watch one people and you hear me go, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh. Ooh, and you know what? You know what this is, guys? Let me put this down. I'll put these. I'll toss this in another bin. I say the bin, but it's just the box. Okay, this is a very elusive thing. This is a Ninja Crane Zord. From the 1990 uh, movie uh, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Now, the reason why it's so elusive is because this is the one thing they all that always gets lost. And what is this character? This is the Megazord that turns into the head. The Ninja Crane Zord turns into the head. Now, one second, let me get over here into my shelf. Um, in that set, you get a frog, a bear. No, this is supposed to be a gorilla, but it looks nothing like the one that was in the movie. Uh, so it is what it is. I was like, oh, okay. He looks nothing like he looks nothing like he's supposed to. So that's all I'm gonna say. Okay. And oh, he also has a thing that goes on his so that clips over his head to make him look uh, change him up. Okay, so here's the wolf. So, now in the movie, it's like, Ninja Frog Zord, Ninja Wolf Zord, Ninja Monkey, or Ninja Gorilla Zord, and Ninja Bear, and Ninja Crane Zord. Now, the funny thing is, this one is always lost. I don't know why it's always lost. But right now, you can buy replicas of it in either its crane form or in its head form, which is literally just this. Okay, you can buy a replica that looks like that. I think these are like six, uh, six to seventy dollars for that. And then it's another 20, 30 bucks for shipping. 
So I'm like, eh, we'll just uh, buy a real one. And the thing is, buying a real one takes forever. And this is one of them one times I'm like, yeah, I'm not going to buy a replica. Or I'm not going to 3D print one. But to be honest, um, the Action Toys channel slash Eric wants to get a 3D scanner. Um, and currently they are on Amazon for $250. So, I want, I'm thinking about, maybe I'll crowdfund that and I'll make a GoFundMe. Or, what's the other one? I'm not sure, I'll, I'll, I'm not sure yet guys. Alright, so, or I'll just make a video saying, hey guys, I need, I want to buy something. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Alright, so, now, you're going to ask, what are these guys? Well, they're all just pretty simple. The frog, look at him. The frog is literally a giant pair of legs. Okay, so his feet. Let's go in there. Stands up. Okay. The bear. Squeeze and put that together. Now there. There. And this connects up on top of here. Somewhere. Oh, right there. Oh yeah, it's supposed to push in, that's what it is. Well, I gotta turn sideways. The benefits of being almost blind. Okay, so there we go. Look at that. He's 50% complete. Okay, now, the wolf guy, he's fairly simple. Oh, I don't know why I did that. Being silly, I guess. Now, with the wolf and the, gor the, the gorilla guy, they come with these, and that's supposed to make it so it looks like a hand. Okay. Wow, this is turning into a not, not a male day video. <laughs> okay, so the gorilla guy. Okay. He pops up like that. The thing goes like that. No, this is where you normally put a thing over his head to make him look like a hand. So, we didn't do that, but oh well. And now, this is the part that's cool. This is probably the easiest one to transform, well, one of the easiest ones to transform out of them all. And this is where he goes up here. Do, 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 do. Ah, I broke it off, I don't care. What's up guys, let me get this off his... Okay, so that's uh, that, it was literally just me couldn't see how to put it in a get it away from the camera to pull up my nose so I could look at it. So there we go. Now we're not. Now we're now. So we now have a complete um, 1990s Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Ninja Zord, which is pretty cool. Which is com it, it's not really the exact same one that's in the show, so you know, not bad. I think it's cool. So that's our mail day item. Uh, I think I paid sixty dollars for the head and shipping was another like fifteen or so. But it's pretty cool. I love it. <sighs> uh, I'm, I'm, I'll probably end up three printing a um, the sword the uh, ninja sword uses is the sword to the uh, uh, Super Sentai Samurai Megazord. Yeah, they are close and so they're very close. I think the main difference is maybe like a couple of a couple of paint schemes and stuff like that, but that's it. I'll have to double check. I'll have to go grab. I'll have to get one, and we'll see. All right, guys. Okay, so this one said it was from Retro Universe. And as always, go check them out. They have a sales page, um, Facebook. Not sponsored, but I like giving them shout outs to people that do great jobs selling selling things. Ah. He got me again. Look at that. <laughs> Delicious. <Whoa. laughs> oh, good. It's not bad. Okay. So, again, in the, um, uh, I think it's the Canadian Toy Gallery. It's the Facebook group. So, if you guys want to check it out, uh, go check it out. Um, just remember that, uh, there are rules and just read the rules and just don't, basically don't be a dick, okay? Oh, you put popcorn in there too! 
Alright, so this is probably going to be mostly Motu. Uh, oh, what Motu parts? Look at that. The Red Man's arm. Ah, every time. The dang nose, man. Oh, I guess I'll restore it. Well, it's a snubby nose in the first place. I don't know why. That's actually a pretty decent chest. Pretty decent. Right. No! Oh. His spring fell out. Oh, well. I'll replace it. Today I did go out and I got a giant assortment of springs. So this is going to be cool. And he's already apart, so we can fix that. All right, and so here's another manic Monday. I don't know. I might have to take his legs apart and see what that looks like. Oh, never mind. I just have to replace the spring. <gasps> Ratman modifications. Okay, cool. All right, oh, give me a second. Give me a second. Let me, let me calm down. Let me calm down. Okay. All right, this is going up top. In line, in, ahead of the line. I just hope I have another arm. That's in here. Okay. Uh, there's a turret. It's busted. Yeah, it's broken. So hopefully that's in here. If not, oh. It's just a tube with another tube on it, right? It's not really missing anything. Just that. Yeah, we'll see about making one. So it's missing that. Oh, oh, three, um, I'll make one in Tinkercad. And then I'll uh, make one. See how it works out. Ah, there we go. No? There. Alright. Take out the He-Man. He's just a He-Man. Oh! Oh, okay, never mind. Guess I'm not. Okay. Here's my Super 7 He-Man right here. That is the head that... That looks pretty good. Now, I got one for Christmas. From my wife, which is awesome. So, this one's going on the shelf. I literally bought this just because I wanted a... Uh, I want. I didn't want to open it. <laughs> Am I weird? Yeah. <laughs> All right. So this is going on. This is gonna go on my shelf. So that's going over there. Oh, look at that, guys! Ooh, Retro Universe. Um, check out. They have um a website. I think it's Retro Universe. Uh, .ca or .com. I can't remember. Um, they post. Um, they talk about He-Man stuff, blogs, um, and stuff like that. Top tens. They're pretty. It's a pretty fun read if you watch it. Okay, here's a card from Toy to Tune. I don't really need to do that. Oh, there's Ratman's alarm! <gasps> this is gonna be our next video for Wednesday. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I am so burnt out with from like previous month where I was like going, all right, six videos, seven videos or more a day. I was like, that's just too much. All right, um, not a big fan of this car but it's cool I like it there we go is it Hot Wheels no it's a McDonald's car that's cool anyway okay King Hiss all right oh look at that yeah, oh look. see how bad the rubber gets yeah see just disintegrates okay cool um and we'll just toss, we'll, I'll, I'll toss them over here for a second. Okay, now, here's what I really was really hoping for. Do you know why? Because I have that, um, uh, Panthor that I got a while back. He was missing a tail. Um, he's broken in half. He was split down the middle and broken in half. So I was like, Ugh! I put him back together and I flocked him in, uh, purple sparkly glitter. I get a lot of love and hate for it. Um, just, uh, what is it? On the, t today, okay, okay, so that would be uh, the 11th. Someone commented and they were swearing at me, saying I ruined it, and all that stuff, and all I could say was, dude, um, taking a figure that was busted into multiple pieces, putting it back together, and then flocking, reflocking it. Um, I just, I just, that's all I said was that. And then I was like, sounds like you're more of a snob because you're mad that I took a busted up piece, bunch of parts and flocked it. And then I was like, you just sound like a snob. I just told him to grow up. And then I pinned it on that. So if you want to look at it, um, what is that? I don't really remember what that video's called. 
but it'll be reflocking Panthor. And then you'll see you'll see the, the picture is a still of him being uh, all, all sparkly and stuff. It's pretty fun. I enjoy it. Oh, I have I have the uh, thing for this, but it's painted black, so it's, I'm gonna have to take that out. I'll, t I'll take the paint, heat it up, and scrub it all off, and it was all nice looking again. Okay, I can't remember this guy's name, but cool. I got parts. I could take I could take um, the arm off and the legs, and then I can put something else on it. I can do like a weird. Be oh, I can't because of the head. I forgot about the head. Hmm. Chop up, uh, pop them open. No, I'll just cut the head off. Um, remove the eyes. Pull this out, fill this in, uh, paint that red, and then I'll, I'll make sure that this uh, when the cut is done, uh, he'll uh, have what do you call it? He'll have a spot where I can put a head inside. So there we go. Cool. Unless there's an arm in here, then that'd be cool. Cooler. Okay, going over there to the other parts. Okay. Oh yeah, that's that thing. Okay, and here's what and here's what I bought this. It's because I didn't have this one yet. Squeeze. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, <laughs> but yeah, this is the one I've uh, before the 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 COVID nineteen thing happened. I'd see this guy for five ten bucks. Um, uh, now he's like 30, 40 bucks. But that was without access. Uh, five ten bucks without accessories, and maybe he had an issue with the legs. You know, so eh, this is pretty cool. I got it at a really good price, anyways. I was happy with it. They were happy with it. So yeah. Whoa. What's this? Ooh, tin of accessories. <gasps> That's amazing. Okay, I'll put this in my box of uh, thing my jigs. Oh, and I dropped it. Okay. All right, and here we go. We got a panther. We're gonna reflock this guy. I think I paid fifteen bucks or less, or it got thrown in. I don't remember. Look at this. He's rattling. So there's a crack somewhere. Yeah, there it is, right there, see? This, okay, now, on the one that I restored, it's cracked like this. It was down here, he went up there, and the crack come down this way, out to the side. So you split down the center, and then this whole quarter was gone. The tail was busted like this one is. Okay. Someone said to take in some sandpaper and did this up. Try to make it look nice. So I can do, I can do, I can do wonders with this guy. Uh huh. So, uh, recap: We have Panthor needs new tail, new tooth, re-glued. Whoops! Ouch! Punch the camera. Um. So yeah, I said he re uh strip is flocking, new tooth, new tail, re-glued. Uh, did a purple flocking. I am gonna. I've um got that. Set, the purple flocking kit is in my uh Amazon wish uh Amazon list right now. Um, I think it's like ninety bucks for the the kit. But I could sit there and do panthers. Oops! I could sit there and do panthers all day after I get the kit. Um, things we got. Can't remember this guy's name because I never do. We got King Hiss, which is cool. Uh, got the saddle. I don't remember what I paid for it, but I think I claimed it right away. So yeah. There we go. Makes me feel better. Horns everywhere. We got squeeze. We got e man We got this piece of broken stuff which we can fix. It's not a big problem. Okay. We got the head of the ninja crane zord. All right. Which, to be honest, in some circles, that's the hardest thing to get. Oof. Sorry about that, but I got some stuff in my gums. All right, let's open this up. Now, oh, this is cool. Okay, what's this? Oh, Tron stick. Oh, are these stickers or cards? Tron cards, huh? Oh, they make this Tron symbol on one side. That's cool. I'm gonna pull out the rest of them. Oh, Superman, that's cool too. Am I supposed to get these? I don't know. <gasps> the passing of Jonathan Kent. Yeah, that sucks. Okay. Oh, it doesn't suck. I'm just like, oh, it sucks that it happened. 
Okay, here's my sword for my Glimdar Keyman with the shield that goes to him. Okay, see what else do we got in here? Okay, we got a, a resin casted axe. That's cool. I think I got the, the hammer for this one a lot before. Okay, I got a ham the hammer for this one a lot before. I think I just threw it in my accessories and it's in the box. That's cool. Oh, here's a leg for King Hiss. I'll put that in the box because he, he's easy. <laughs> I got a neck peg. I got Skeletor's torso. That's actually pretty cool. I can you can you can make a nice custom with that. You don't because you don't need to have Skeletor as as this guy out the whole time. You got Skeletor's legs, which is good. Oh wow, 3D printed, not bad. Hmm. I think it's missing something though. Something I don't know. I can't remember. I'm old. I can't remember stuff all the time. Uh huh. <laughs> Let me see. Yeah, it's coming off. So that's a marker. It's not marker. It's a paint marker. Kind of looks like a paint marker. I would use. It's black, metallic. -y. Yeah. Yeah. So that's not bad. More heads to go into the head bag. <laughs> Uh huh. So this this literally makes a complete thing. No, I've literally just said I went out and bought springs. Look at that, they fixed it. Why didn't they put it together? Then I wonder. One second, guys. Uh. Wow. I must be really animated today to keep smacking this stuff up. Okay, does it go this way, or does it go this way? I don't remember. Oh, I see what's going on. It needs to be modified a little bit. Hmm. That's cool. I would just glue it in place because... Nah. I think this is pretty cool. Look at this, guys. Ninja sword. <laughs> I actually, you know what? I might take a... If I, if I could find an STL file of this, I might take it, remix it, put a skull there, and a spike down there. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, oh, this goes to my other guy. All right, guys. Oh, I'm gonna put this over here. This is this is a, this is a, this is a level of uh, neatness that I'm not used to for myself. Because literally, this, this I used to go arms go in one bag, legs go in one bag, head goes in another bag, uh, pelvis, you know, all that just sort of like be super anal about it. <laughs> um, but yeah, all right, guys. This video has gone on for way too long. I'm I, I'm I'm just I just hope that um, you enjoyed it. Uh, you seen something that you thought was cool. And as always, stay awesome. Bye.